Over the weekend, the students at Alma Bryan High School were treated to a host of different Christmas festivities, including parties and the recent Christmas voice competition. But while these festivities bring Christmas cheer to our students, this Christmas party means something a little different for both the hosts and the students. Today is our annual Christmas party for our AAA students here at Bryant, hosted by Coach Miller. Coach Miller has always given presents to his students ever since he became a member of Kane Nation over 20 years ago. But not until several years ago was the Christmas party first held for special education students. So I started out a long time ago here at Bryant High School. And when I first started, I was in a classroom with seven AAA students. Um, those students, uh, some of them I still talk to today, but I was able at that point in time to be able to give them a, a small present during Christmas time. And just the look on their face was something that I'll never forget. So I wanted each year to kind of grow on that. And in these last six years, um, it's become something that uh, is very huge. These students are special to me. They hold a special place in my heart and they know that Coach Miller loves them and I'll do anything for them. Um, but to be able to just give them the smallest of gifts, you know, they're, they're so appreciative. Um, Ms. Moore and Coach Logan work with them and Ms. Tipton work with them during the school year. Uh, they, they wrote a letter to us, so they kind of included it in their curriculum and in their, in their school work during the day. Uh, Ms. Moore got with them and, and made them write notes to us um, about what they wanted for Christmas um, with a list. So that was pretty cool to get something from them. Um, just these kids are something else. Um, they deserve happiness and they deserve someone to um, look after them. And I think that's what the student body administration staff here at Brown High School does. And what does it mean to students who receive these gifts? And how do they feel when the party is over? We asked some of these students what the party means to them. I had a good time. Opening the presents and eating. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. And as you know, he couldn't pull this party off without a little help from our community bringing these students a holiday happiness. This event cannot be put on if it wasn't for uh, my mom, Tanya Woodward, Raven Miller, my wife, Kelly Miller, um, all of them have really helped out. My wife wraps every single gift. We had over 100 gifts this year for the students, and my wife, uh, she wrapped probably 95% of them. So I, I couldn't do it without her. Uh, my sister and my mom own a, a boutique here in Grand Bay along with a shirt company, and they reach out to their followers, their customers, and their customers have been so generous in helping uh, donate toys, uh, clothes, money, gift cards, just anything you can think of. My mom and them ask, and they got such great uh, people that buy from them and great people in our community that just help out. It's, it's crazy. It's tremendous. Uh, I, that's one of the reasons I love being in this community. We've had numerous people help out this year. We can go from Sam Superburger to the people at the Lighthouse to Why Not, Fair Weatherly. Uh, some of our administrators here, Mr. Arrington, Mr. Burks, uh, some of our teachers here, all the teachers on G Hall helped me out in some way, uh, whether it was with presents and gifts for the students or helping me out with the party itself. I, I couldn't do it without them. Long and Long also is another group that has helped out for the last couple of years, and, and they help out tremendously in, in a lot of things that I do here at Bryan High School, especially for our, our special needs students. I want to thank everyone for helping out. If it wasn't for them, I couldn't put this on. Thank you to the community people. Uh, thank you to the, the staff uh, and teachers here at Bryant High School. Thank you to my wife, my mom, and my sister. Uh, thank you to the businesses that have helped out. If it wasn't for all of y'all, this would not be possible. So thank you very, very much. Of course, no party can last forever. However, at the end of the day, one thing is for certain. Everyone deserves to take part in spreading joy this holiday season, and this party was a perfect example of it. I'm Brianna Eaton. And I'm Alexis Gulen. Reporting, reporting from, from Alma Bryant High School. School. Thank you, Mary.